ultimately we were brought together through Gremlin, the dog. One of my best friends, Megan, um, she had followed Gremlin's Facebook page for years and used to ask me to go check the page out and look at these pictures and isn't this guy cute? And, and he was. One day she or texted me and said, I just want you to know I emailed Chris and he responded. And I read the message and I'm like, is it weird for me to respond? But I was at a moment of my life where I didn't have anybody. So he texted me and then we spoke on the phone and then we started um, Skyping and and we met soon after that and I guess all those cliche things that people tell you you'll just know when you know and it happens when you're not looking for it and all that silly stuff is completely true. When I first spoke with her on the phone I knew she was somebody incredibly special. It's one of those things like it's like we've been friends for years the way we talked and I'm like you know this is a special girl. And, Right after we got engaged, Gremlin got really sick. It made me think maybe Gremlin knew that she's now set me up with the girl I'm gonna spend the rest of my life with, the girl who's gonna take care of me from here. Thank God she is fine now and she's obviously not sick anymore. Gremlin stands for so much. For her breed and for... Um, rescue in general. Rescue and now to be responsible for two people meeting from two different states, and it's tremendous. So she, I, I owe Gremlin and Megan my happiness. Thank you, Megan. Thank you, Megan. We're little crazy dog people, but that's okay. That's why we love each other, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs>